so hello everyone welcome again and uh, i'm back with uh, another project in php is a fresh shop it's kind of e-commerce application so i'm running this at my local machine so if you need this source code you can check the description box and we'll provide the complete source code with project report database and uh, we'll provide the configuration also if you need some kind of uh, remote configuration so how can you run that project at your machine then provide remote uh, on the remote basis also so just uh, check the description box and you can contact me easily so uh, let's uh, move to the functionality of the project how the project is working what are the roles and the database and also i'm just moved to my database so the fresh shop is the project name of the project so if you can check the user table there is a admin the role id one will be for the admin and all other id will be for the users so here uh, we have two role in the application admin and the user and we have product table to manage the detail to maintain the detail of products and the payment for to maintain the details of payment and the customer detail here in the customer table so this is the home page simple sliders there and uh, the footer we have and if you are going to visit the application as a user you can just view the products so right now this projects are product are available in the database so whenever uh, when i'm gonna log in the application and going to show you like how admin can uh, perform his functionality so here we have one admin user in the table user is this one so uh and the password for the admin is one two three four five it's already saved in my browser cookies so i logged in as an admin on um, you can see the functionality that admin can perform the operations so admin can add a new admin he just need to fill the detail email password in the confirm password and the second thing admin must need to admin can uh, add a new product in the application so let me show you an example how can admin product show the uh, uh, product there so uh, first uh, you need to enter admin needs to enter the code of the products for example I, I pass this code and demo demo product I'm gonna enter the name as a demo product and the quantity like for example we have three product the choice the project price is like this and uh, I want to choose an image to upload to show the product. So, in a simple image. So, for example, I'm going to take this image. So, product is added successfully. You can see, check the response message here. And when I move to product section, you can see the new product with the price 233 is edited. Uh, and edit there. <coughs> if user want, if you want as an admin, you want to edit. The product you can edit like i'm gonna change the name after editing and i'm gonna pass this name over there so i just update the thing the data updated data is successfully and you can change the name it's changed now and if user want to edit as an admin you want to edit de uh, delete the product you can delete just click on the delete click okay Product is deleted the page refresh automatically and you can the rearrangement here so these are the product detail for the admin section and if you move to the customer these are the current customer who's interacted with the application till now so it's showing the data from the database and the tables are uh, performing all the operation like show, um, like uh, if you want to filter the data according to the quantity like 10 20 or 35 and if, or if you want to show the data this shorting is also working over there and um, this contact detail and the search functionality like demo if you want to select the 22 you can uh, perform search operation any of the field like it will i'm gonna check a phone number so 7543 and once the data is reached uh, like 10 record or more than 10 record the next button will be enabled and you can uh, move to the next button if as an admin you want to delete some data you can click on this button this icon cross icon and the data is gone 
you can see the data is gone so the delete operation is also working searching also working short and so these are the functionality for the customer and for the payment section also all the same functionalities like searching shorting and edit delete so you know, uh, in the payment section also you can do the things so booked list so these product are booked so you can check it and uh, i'm gonna log out from the admin now and going to log in as a user so before logged in as a user if i want to from a new user in the application i want to view the product and going to book now it will ask you to log in in the application so i'm gonna uh, log in as a new user so new user and the id will be like new user at the rate gmail.com i'm using this credit uh, this data as a dummy you can use your own data and uh, enter the confirm password six and as age seven and the contact number over there any contact number and like this click on the save so my id is new user at the red gmail and the password is one two three four five six now after registration it will ask you to log in in the application so let log in and enter the password so now you are logged in in the application and now you can book in the product here so if you wanna check the book list so right now the product is not there any products and if you wanna enter the card details and card holder name so new user and the card number and if you're gonna select a date over there from the calendar expiry date for example I'm taking this date and you're gonna enter the CCV number and I'm gonna click on the save button the eight payment successfully so it means the product is booked by you if i'm gonna check the booking book list now the one product is added there so admin will get the request or uh, that product in the book list and you can process accordingly so these are the complete functionality of the application and we are using that it's, it's, it's completely php project built in the php for the front end as well we are using the html and the javascript and css things so finally if you need the source code uh, you can contact me in the below detail just check the description box we'll provide the complete complete uh, step by step configuration and if you need the tutorials or if you want to learn the php development and how can we develop this kind of product which will provide the classes also and uh, i'm going to show you one more thing like we have started the new uh, blog for the wordpress and the php right now we have some uh, initial um, articles on the wordpress only and if you are a php developer or if you're gonna learn the wordpress developer you can view this article we'll provide the link in the description box and these are the really tricky uh, concepts are there like how can you write the short code and the step-by-step -step explanation is there so in future we are gonna add some more uh, post for the basic to advance uh, development in the php and the wordpress so you can check that link here thank you so much for watching thank you